We're super proud about our cheese. I think there's a lot of heritage, not just with our Cheshire, but with the Cheshire from Shropshire, Cheshire, Staffordshire. This area produced such a huge amount of this absolutely beautiful, classic territorial cheese from this amazing dairy area. We essentially see ourselves as farmers, uh, very traditional farmers, keen on our breeding and how we feed the cows to produce the quality milk we need for the cheese. My grandparents came here, they milked the cows, they made the cheese and they used the whey from the cheese making to feed the pigs. So I'd say the farm has become relatively modern but the cheese making itself has remained exactly as it was. Sarah and I obviously running it now and hoping that someday one of the children will take over, one of our five children, and continue and be the fourth generation of Applebee's. We make the cheese right next to my kitchen. It, it, it's a it's, it's really intrinsic part of our farm life. Here we do everything. We, we, we milk the cows, uh, we produce the cheese here, it's all stored here, and yeah, we select and send out our cheese from here. We're now one of the last producing the, the Cheshire cheese as it was then. The cheese maker now, Gary, who um, makes it, and myself and my father, we've all been influenced greatly by my grandmother. I've been making Cheshire most of my life. Yeah, this is how it should be made. Just getting your hands in, just to give it a general feel so you know what stage you're at. I don't think there's a better Cheshire. It's still stored for several months, and, and all of that involves an awful lot of manual work. Uh, the labels are hand stitched on, it's still very, very traditional. They're rubbed and turned every day to keep the moisture even throughout the body of the cheese. It's time consuming, but it's something that we think is incredibly important. When people taste it, hopefully they get, they get that picture of something that's really special. It's, it's soft, delicious, with the lemony, zesty flavours, and then it sort of mellows out with the dairy, slightly caramelly undertones that's typical of, of a traditional artisan Cheshire. We were really excited to hear that Waitrose are, are celebrating us artisan producers by doing a Waitrose One range, and we're absolutely thrilled to be part of that. It's not punchy, it's not powerful, it's subtle and something that, that should make you come back again and again, I guess.